Hey guys, so now I come. It's Jenny G. Welcome back to my channel. So this is just a recap video of our Florida trip. Now it was a nice couple of days and we were really excited just to take you guys along with us. So we left Piaco. Uh, we took the afternoon flight. We flew into the Fort Lauderdale airport. Now that flight normally takes about three and a half hours. It was a nice flight. We flew with our Caribbean Airlines, so no complaints at all. And when we got into Fort Lauderdale, uh, hotel we went we had a straight to the hotel actually so because it was the afternoon time we got in the hotel we stayed in was located near to the Fort Lauderdale airport and it was called Best Western and it's just along the beach actually so it's a pretty nice hotel so if you guys are in Fort Lauderdale head in there you know be sure to check them out if you want to be on the beach now while we were in Florida in Fort Lauderdale area we were able to actually make it to our Friday uh, pray or Jummah and we went to a masjid just located uh, located just off of sunrise boulevard which is a couple of minutes away from the hotel we stayed in and there we got some nice halal food and they've got like coconut water and some other nice local kind of uh, stuff caribbean kind of stuff being sold too now after the masjid now well what's a trip without supping in at a mall right so we headed to sawgrass mills which is actually an outlet mall located not too far away from the mosque actually just off sunrise boulevard as well and while we were there, we came across this unique, super cool, lovely donut spot um, with some really nice different donuts. Now, I didn't eat any of the donuts, but I love the presentation and the idea behind it. We definitely should try to get something like that here in Trinidad. Uh, we also came across a sushi spot located just opposite the donut spot too, actually, with a unique conveyor belt set up. So you basically sit... And you choose the items you want off the belt and the plate color tells you the price and once you finish eating you just pay that's pretty cool after a few days in fort lauderdale uh we made a road trip up north to daytona port orange uh area and the drive takes about three and a half hours non-stop but you can stop off and make it fun so on our way we stopped off at smoothie king they make smoothies using natural and healthy ingredients as their aim is to promote healthy lifestyle so our choice was pretty good i find it was pretty nice and after that we hit the road and we were on the way to Daytona Port Orange area we headed up uh, on the 95 made a pit stop for some gas and yeah it took about three it took us about six hours we were on the road because we made another stop as well after the smoothie king spot and after the gas spot but when we finally got to our destination in that area we had some lovely homemade food waiting for us now we can't resist a stew chicken right so yeah we had a nice spread waiting for us uh when we got there so we sat down and you know in two twos everything was just gone now while we were in the daytona area um we went bowling at a place called game time which is just off daytona boulevard and that was so much fun although i lost the funny thing is i was the one who actually been bowling before and i was so excited to take these two guys with me but i lost course m1 of course chicken came in second and i came in third you all don't even want to hear this sto the score totally embarrassing but absolutely fun so while we were in that area uh, i checked out walmart because i really wanted to make some trini food and because where we were staying was a house so there was a kitchen i really really was excited to actually cook up a storm because you all know i like to go crazy in the kitchen so we checked out walmart and uh because there wasn't any halal meat there, I decided to go with a menu which included fish. So I picked up a couple of items. Um, I even was surprised. To, I was even surprised to see Kulancho Shadow Benny there because I've never seen Shadow Benny in any of the WalMarts I have been to before. So it was pretty exciting to see it. And uh, we also stopped into Bravo Supermarket, which is located just off Nova Road in the Daytona area. And I went crazy to see home away from home. Now this particular Bravo only recently started including so much of the Trini or Caribbean items. So I was so excited to see from mangoes to tamarind, they even have halal meats as there's a mosque located close by actually and there are a lot of Trinis um, around the area and not to mention my favorite thing, smoked heron. So these things were just recently be, uh, started added, uh, being added to this particular Bravo supermarket. I know a lot of you are saying that you know you all know where to get your trini stuff so yes i agree but location um also plays a huge factor in what's available so 
a couple of times actually you wouldn't even find shadow benny at this particular bravo you know so it's it's, it's something that they now sign to include on a regular basis so i picked up a couple of stuff there too and my menu was just getting longer and longer but i was just so excited to just get in the kitchen and cook up something so the final menu actually included dal rice fried fish chana and alu smoke herring pak choy mango chow cucumber chow and watercress now this was just fun for me to do it was it took us about two hours to get everything done and uh, this is how basically our trip ended because we were supposed to fly out the day after actually so we headed out from orlando airport but unfortunately i only got footage on my phone and it wasn't much but i totally love this airport and there's even a prayer area a prayer room and not to mention there's a hotel in the airport hyatt is actually in the airport like right there so it's pretty nice pretty nice a uh, pretty airport huge for sure thank you guys so much as always for watching and for just tagging along on the journey and yeah tell us where you think we should head to next let's have another adventure somewhere so send your suggestions down below comment let us know and i'll see you guys in the next video